Hello everyone, welcome to Encryption, the tech tips and tutorial channel. Guys, welcome back again to at another video tutorial of Microsoft Excel. In this video, we are going to learn how to import the data from a TXT file or notepad to an Excel sheet. Let's get started. Here I have a sample table with some sample data. I copied this sample table from a website to my Excel sheet. The link of the website that provided the sample table is as shown on the screen. Also, you can find the link of the sample table in the description below. First of all, let's export the table as a TXT document or the notepad file and we will learn how to import it back on the Excel sheet. Click on the file menu and then click on the export. Then click on the change file type. Here on the change file types section, then under the other files types section, click on the text tab delimited.txt and click on the save as button. Now locate the folder on your computer where you want to save this file, which is in the .txt file type. Here we can see the warning that states some features in your workbook might be lost if you save it as text. This means that the formatting such as the bold text on the title and the background color in the boxes may be lost in the new txt file. So it asks for your confirmation whether you want to continue or not. You can simply click on S yes button to continue. Exporting is done and we can see that the original file is not hampered on any way. That's great. Now going to the text file storage location and double clicking on the txt file to open it, we can see all the data with their header is exported from the excel sheet to the txt file or the notepad file. The title total is moved a bit far towards the right. You can adjust it on the correct position if you want to. Otherwise, the file looks perfectly fine. Further, you can save the changes in a new file because the existing file is used by another process. But if you haven't made any changes, you can just replace the file with this one. Moving on, let's import the txt file or the data of the txt file to an excel sheet. First, let's create a new excel file by pressing the shortcut keys Ctrl plus N. Then to import the data from the txt file, click on the data menu. Here on the left side of the data menu, we can see the different options from where or what type of file you can import the data from to an excel sheet. For this demo, we are going to do it from the text file. So click on the from text option. Then locate the text file and click on the open button. Here you have two options to choose the file type that best describes your data. The one is delimited and the other is fixed width. Since our text file format is on the tabs separated, we can choose the delimited and continue. Next, our data has headers or the files. So check on my data has headers checkbox. Here we can see the preview of the file that we are going to import. Now click on the next button. Here the screen lets you set the delimiters uh, your data contains. Also you can see how your text is affected in the preview below. Since our data contains tab delimiters, leave the tab checkbox checked and click on the next button. Here too, we don't need to modify anything. So leaving the general selected, click on the finish button. Lastly, Excel asks you where you want to put the data that is on the existing sheet or a new sheet. If you are working on a Excel file which already have the data on it and you want to import on the same file but in the new sheet, you can define the sheet here by clicking on the new worksheet. Since this file does not have any data on it, you can click on the OK button. Now as you can see, all the data from the txt file is imported to an excel sheet including the headers on order. The total is moved towards own tab left. This is because we moved it own tab back on the txt file uh, sometimes earlier. If you hadn't, uh, then it would have been on its place. We can always correct the minor changes easily however. 
Now you can do some formatting to the Excel file if you want to and save the file in your preferred location. Okay guys, this is how we can export an Excel sheet to a TXT file and import the TXT file back to an Excel sheet in a very easy steps. That's it for this video. I hope the video was useful to you. Please subscribe the channel and hit the bell icon. Thanks for watching. See you on other videos. Goodbye.